today I was going to do a natural eye look, but I don't really think that this is great lighting for one. I mean, it's okay, but I just wanted to do something different for a change. So today I'm going to do the tag um, Perfect Imperfections. I think that's what it's called. And I'm also going to tie a little bit of a vlog type thing about confidence because it does kind of tie into this tag and it ties into a lot of your life. So yeah, I'm just going to start now. Um, I'm going to do two things I don't like and then two things I do like. So the first two things I don't like about myself are the first thing is I don't like my hairline because it's just not even like see how it goes into my head more and then here it's crooked and then it goes a little bit further out. It's just it doesn't match. I just don't like it and even in the camera it bothers me. So yeah I don't like my hairline and then I do like parts of my nose but other parts like if you look at from if you look at it from the side oh my gosh I just don't like it it has a little bump if you can see and I don't like that I'm jealous of people that have like the straight nose I wish I had that so yeah um from my point of view I think it looks straight ish when you're just facing me like this but if you look from the side forget it it's not straight so um yeah those are the two things I don't like, my hairline and my nose, parts of it. And then two things I do like, you're probably not going to see the first one really well because this is bad lighting, like I said. Um, the first thing is my eyes. I have two different color eyes. Yeah, eye color. And this one is blue and this one is brownish hazelish it's really cool a brownish hazel hazelish color and this one's this one has a little bit of green in it it's like a bluish green and I thought that was really cool. like I like it and cuz cuz it was ugh, I can't talk sorry it's cool and I like it because it's unique and not a lot of people have two different colored eyes so I think that's something unique about myself and then the second thing I like about myself is probably my lips um, because my like some people tell me that I have like good lips and I, I I don't know I just like them because they're not like out there like big lips but they're not like thin so I think they're like perfect they fit my face basically and I thought that was good so yeah those are my lips <laughs> that was kind of awkward, but um, I wanted to incorporate confidence into this video because some of the tag I don't really like because you're pointing out your own flaws and it's not always good to point out your own flaws and um, I really, I think that it's important that you have confidence in yourself because if you don't have confidence in yourself, guess what? People are not going to believe in you either. So when someone says to you, oh, you have the most beautiful eyes, you should say thank you. Don't say n no, but thanks anyway, they stink. No, you should really say, oh, thank you, and maybe compliment them back because you want them to know, hey, that girl has confidence. I wish I was like her. Or, I mean, you shouldn't wish you were like anyone else because everyone's perfect in their own little way. Well, not perfect, but everyone, you know, they are good in their own way. But they should wish they had confidence like you because even if you don't have confidence, you should give off like you have confidence not not too much confidence but like enough to go around and be okay with yourself um confidence really really like I just thought about this it really impacts your life because um when somebody's interviewing you for work or for if you're like going to a school um they want to see confidence in yourself oh yes I play volleyball and I I think I'm 
okay at it, I guess. I'm not saying I am, but like other people, oh yes, I play basketball, I'm amazing. Don't say that, but be like, yeah, I did well and everything. I think I'm a pretty good player. But um, just go around and at least pretend you have some confidence because if you don't, you know, some people who have a really low self-esteem can bring other people down and then that causes them not to have self-esteem. So if someone does bring you down, you just have to ignore it and say, you know what, I'm okay with myself. You know what, there is good things about myself and I know sometimes that things can go wrong and not the way I want them to go, but you know what, I am okay with myself and that's all I have to, that's all, I just need to be okay with myself. I don't care if anybody else is not okay with myself. That's something you really gotta tell yourself because if you're not okay with yourself, nobody else is gonna be okay with you. That's all I'm just, I'm just saying. That's what, I mean, I know I'm not like a really old person, I, but what I've learned from life so far is that you do need to be okay with yourself because, you know, you're going to wish you were something else and you were going to wish you were someone else and you were going to wish that you had a different life, but you have your life and you have to be okay with it. And um, I think that's really important because it really impacts you, like I said, and your friends are going to think about you differently if you don't have confidence and if you do have confidence you know you have to be okay with yourself and you need to give people confidence too. share some confidence give them compliments tell them they look amazing in that dress tell them they have really pretty hair tell them all the good things about them never tell them anything bad because you never know even if you don't show emotion or they don't show emotion you never know how it is when you're not with them. They could really, 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 really feel bad. They have feelings. Everyone has feelings. Even if they don't show it, they have feelings. So that's really important. Just spread the love, spread the confidence, you know. I think that's really important. And yes, people are going to bring you down. There is no fact. I mean, if that makes sense. No fact. No. I meant, like, you know. There is no, I don't know the word for it, but I hope you get what I mean. You know that people are going to bring you down. And you know what? All you have to say to them, just walk away. You don't even have to say anything to them. Don't say anything to them. Because they're not worth it if they're going to come up to you and say, you, I hate your shirt. What's wrong with you? They, they keep it to themselves. They need to keep it to themselves. You just walk away and be like, you know what? I like this shirt. It's like me. Um, it's my it's it's my personality, you know. I like it, so I'm gonna be okay with it. And I think that's something you need to be okay with. And you know, people are just mean sometimes. People can just be awful to other people, and you need to be okay with yourself because it's really important you are. And if you're not, you should work on it. Like, New Year's resolutions. New Year's are coming up. New Year's is coming up. I can't talk today. I'm so tired. But I think that's something everybody should work on, being okay with themselves, complimenting other people. You know, if they're not so sure of themselves, reassure themselves. Such amazing. Reassure, mm -hmm. reassure them that they are a good person, or they are pretty, or they, what they're wearing is great. Don't, don't bring them down. I think I've said that maybe like a billion times in this video. Be the better person. That's a good thing to say. Be the better person. Don't, don't stand for people that are saying nonsense to you. Just be the better person. Walk away. No, don't, don't walk too high headed. Don't walk too high-headed. That could be a mess. But be level-headed. Be, be like, you know what? I'm going to have good days. I'm going to have bad days. But I'm happy with myself. I'm happy with my friends. I'm happy with my family. And if you're not, you really should work out 
with um, the problems that you're having with confidence or with anything else. And confidence is really a big part of life because it can decide, it can decide your job and your school and your friends and like your circle of friends and group and all that stuff. It really, 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 really impacts your life in many ways like that and backstabbing and how other people are just so mean. You have to be okay with yourself. You just have to tell yourself that. And like I said, good New Year's resolutions. Have more confidence. All that good stuff. So, yeah, that was a pretty, that was a shortish rant, but that was a rant. And I just, I just, like, I don't know. I just want to help out if I can and give advice if I can. If I can't, I'm sorry. Don't watch my videos. <laughs> I just try. Yeah. So, I hope you guys like this video a little bit. Um, let me know if you want me to get a vlog, because I won't do this on my regular channel, really, because I feel like bad if people don't want to watch vlogs that just want to watch makeup. So, let me know, guys. Um, thanks for watching. I really hope you guys like this, and maybe you took something away from it. Um... It's just what I've learned from my personal experience. So I tried, yeah, to give some advice. But if it didn't work, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, sorry, I guess. So yeah, I hope you guys are having a good holiday. And um, let me know if you have any ideas. Like I said, just let me know. I will look at them and see if I can do them. And yeah. So, thanks for watching. Bye, guys. Oh, yeah, and please subscribe if you have a chance. Bye.